Hello and welcome to uh, Let's Play Assassin's Creed Origins. Uh, last time we uh, had a look at some um, documents on uh, Leila Hassan's computer in the modern day and we got some cyclosporin which we uh, need to be able to stay in the animus so let's jump back into the animus. Do you want to return to the animus? Yes. Going back in. This is so badass. Be careful. Title drop. Yamu surroundings, 48 BCE. Alexandria's where the snake thrives and Aya lives. I must find them both. Unlocked Thebes, recommended level 44. Yeah, now uh, we'll get access to a lot of uh, the uh, different um, DLCs and extra quests and whatnot. So let's just let everything unlock before we go on. Letter from Tahira. Bayek, I cannot convey the sorrow with which I write to you. The Sinai is in revolt against the Romans. Two hidden ones got caught up in a massacre and have been killed. I am solely responsible. I am the one who trained them. I am struggling to keep the hidden ones together and have allied with the rebel leader Gamilat. I need your wise counsel, dear friend. I have made arrangements to ferry you across the Red Sea. Please come, Tahira. Uh, so this is the um, introduction to the um, hidden one uh, DLC. It's a sort of a bit of a spoiler, uh, because um, you're expected to uh, have completed the game by this time. But anyway, new quest, Secrets of the First Pyramids. Alright, so let's uh, just have a look at where we are. We are currently in the uh, Ement Gnome. I believe, I don't know how you pronounce the name Gnome, uh, it's... Um, an old form of division in uh, Egypt. I believe they use it still, actually. Uh, anyway, Nome or Nome, I don't know. Ement is the Western Nome uh, because of its situation regarding Yamu and the lake. Okay. <clears throat> so let's see. Yeah, we got a letter. And uh, yeah, we got a few new quests. I will refrain from reading these until we are. Uh, able to, uh, or uh, until we are at the level appropriate uh, to do these quests. Uh, I will, in any case, do the um, DLCs last. <clears throat> but for now, uh, we have the quest called simply Aya. Bayek travels to Alexandria to search for his wife. Uh, having killed Maduna Moon in Siwa, Bayek bid farewell to his friend Hepsifa and set out across the desert to Alexandria. There, his wife Aya has been researching the other masked men. He must find her, knowing only the approximate location of her cousin's house. Together, they will plot their next move. All right, we are uh, going to Alexandria. Uh, now, I'm a little bit torn if I want to go to Alexandria first, or if I want to stop on the way. Oh yeah, let's have a look at this. There's a burning bush. On to my old friend Menehet. He will be in the temple. He always is. Interesting. The um, you can get a lot of different um, hallucinations when you're out in the desert. Uh, you'll get heat strokes and have different interesting visions. Whoa. So in the distance you can see Alexandria. The yeah. big tower there is the pharaohs. 
uh, one of the seven wonders of the world. Uh, it has since, since sunk to the sea, but uh, some archaeologists uh, dug it up in, <clears throat> I don't remember, the 60s or something. New region discovered, Lake Mariotis. So let's read about that. That's this area. The Mariotis Lake is the largest in the Egyptian kingdom and is essential for naval transport. So I th think I think I will just um, no I I will I will do the quests along the way up to Alexandria. So let's see what we did we get ambush in the temple. Um, yeah, I think I will do everything sort of in order just to be um, just to be properly leveled when we get to uh, I mean we are level 8 the Aya quest is level 10 so we're not that under leveled but I think it's good to be uh, over leveled rather than under leveled Bayek visits the Yamu temple to catch up with his old friend Menehet Arriving in the village of Yamu Bayek pays a visit to his old friend Menehet at the temple Menhet explains that Yamu is preparing for a religious festival meant to attract tourists to the village. Their tour of the temple is interrupted by the arrival of Menhet's children, playing a game of hide and seek into which Bayek is recruited. Alright, interesting. So I don't think I will pick up these quests until I'm ready to actually do them. Oh, before we go to the temple, let's... Um, well, first of all, let's uh, get this... Uh, well, first, first of all, let's uh, unlock some uh, abilities. Ah, now I can finally get my sleep darts. So, I have unlocked the tool pouch. Uh, launch these darts to put lower ranked enemies or animals to sleep and move past them without being detected. So, let's see if I can nail this guy. There we go. Oh, too late. That went well. Excellent. Oh, another uh, group of... Uh... Okay, let's um, see what we can upgrade. Melee damage, tool pouch uh, capacity, or quiver capacity. I want the quivers, actually. There we go. Playing a dangerous game here <laughs> at this low level. I think I should think about uh, maybe operating my uh, health. <laughs> okay, oh, see what I mean? Oh no. Who's shooting arrows? Oh, I should uh, maybe. Uh... Oh, I nailed him. I think I will have a uh, light bow for this. Ooh, level 10. <laughs> yeah, I'm probably dead. Let's see how this goes. Ooh. Ooh, let's go. Ooh. No sweat. Oh, I'm not safe yet. Hold on. Uh, no, I will miss. Damn it. That was bad. <laughs> I 
This is nightmare difficulty. No joke. Where is the last one? Ooh. Sorry, goat. All right. <laughs> Let's see what else we can upgrade. Yeah, I think I will upgrade some. Uh, no, I can't upgrade health yet. Okay. Well, quivers it is. So there's a reason um, I'm taking these chances fighting everyone. Uh, we get crafting materials, but um, as you can see, it is quite dangerous. Actually, let's try a little bit of mounted combat. Might be easier, actually. At this level, at least. Alright, let's get you. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I should uh, have a different gear. I have a level 3 sword. Yeah, this, is, this wouldn't work. So actually, this one does a lot of damage more than the swords, but uh, yeah. So even though this is level one, it just it does just a little less than this level seven sickle sword. But this has bleeding on hit, and this has this also has bleeding on hit. Yeah, I'll go for the fang. <laughs> yeah, a little bit better, but. Um, yeah, I'm a little bit um, under leveled for this, I think. But let's not give up. All right. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Well, let's try not to get ourselves into trouble then. Alright, so let's uh, visit um, everyone's favorite, Redda. He uh, gives us um, daily quests to complete. Uh, I will complete, I think, one of them, uh, but I, this is not something I will be doing every uh, every stream. Let's talk to him. Great warrior, come. I sell you what you want. You need it, I have it. If I don't have it, you don't need it. Redda has your back in these desolate lands. You are but a boy. How did you come by such fine treasure? Plucked from the ancient lands of the desert, the sunken vessels of the Nile, refined by handmaidens of the gods. Weapon reforged in Nubian mines, Persian jewels, and Assyrian treasures. I have it all. I see. You are well traveled for such a young man. Old wisdom, Ned. I have acquired from long nights in the desert with my camel. I will see what you have. Come, look around. If you want good net, I have other jobs too. Nomad's Bazaar. The camel icon shows you Reda the merchant's position. Reda offers a wide variety of very rare goods. Be sure to check with him regularly as his stock changes weekly. Every day, Reda offers a new quest to help someone in need. Succeed before the time runs out and you'll be greatly rewarded for your efforts. All right. So it seems he has a quest for us. I heard there are bandits harassing me. Likely with a reward already on their heads. I know, as I'm the one who put the reward out for them. Bandits are not good for business. So this was a bandit trade, um, and it actually doesn't send us too far. Uh, we might, yeah, we, we will do this, actually. Um, there is one quest which sends us there anyway, so we will uh, keep that in mind. A bandit group has been sighted raiding around these parts, time to get rid of the menace. So you see the reward is 500 XP and a mystery item, that is uh, 
uh, a hacker chest. Uh, you can also buy hacker chests uh, for 3000 uh, drachma. Contains one rare or legendary weapon or shield or sometimes something uh, of even greater value. Opens automatically on purchase. So, um, yeah, I won't bother to do these every time. Uh, I might do it at the end. Uh, you can also buy carbon crystals. Uh, which is a legendary crafting material, mainly found in military camps. This, these crystals resemble precious gems and thus are often found in jewelry boxes. We will not be buying any of this. Uh, it's wasted. Um, uh, you do find enough of them in the world. But uh, you could buy them here if you want to upgrade your, uh, your stats and tools earlier in the game. So, let us... Do the ambush in the temple quest. And also synchronize this viewpoint. Yeah, even though this game is from 2017, I think it uh, still looks amazing. Let's do a leap of faith. Let's go meet Menahet. I thought it would be years before we saw you again. Hail in peace, Menahet. How is your family? <laughs> the children seem to grow larger by the minute. My wife and I have our hands full. And you? Is there any news of... None. I forget myself. There are so many things in your life best not spoken of. Forgive me. I see by your garb that you have been promoted. Ah, yes. The High Priest, in his grace, made me his second. And my rank is not the only thing he has changed. You must see the temple. You will give me a tour? Of course, of course. At the moment of your pleasure. Ready to see our beautiful temple? After you, Menehet. Or is it... Servant of the Goddess. Menahet will do for one as good as family. It is far from the sorry ruin of my last visit. Yamu now plays constant host to ceremonies showing our rustic way of life, which attract many visitors with more gold than sense. Uh, a description well suited to Alexandrians. How does this sit with your faith? I confess that my thoughts are sometimes uneasy. Side. It's me up, Uncle Bayek! Ah, see now, there's no need to attack a man from behind when I'm numbering him four to one. Huh? You told us to secure every advantage possible over a tender's foe. Yes, yes, yes. And I am very dangerous! <laughs> Hide well, for the wanderer stalks your path! Alright, so let's find the children. Using our eagle, let's also find these uh, 
Items of interest. You're getting in the priest's way. So this mission is also sort of like an introductory mission to um, some of the game mechanics. Let's read this. Oh, Sekhmet, source of strength and mercy. I am beset by sorrow and many troubles. Wounded by injustice and the uh, offensive wrongdoing of others, grant me the strength to meet adversary adversity with quiet courage and unshaken will. Ayla, are you following me? You might get lost without me. If you pick them beast, you will meet your end at the hands of the mighty gladiator Sodius. Oh, let's protect them. down from here this would be a good place to watch the stars only the priests are permitted here you know that yes but i want to see hush come down now we can watch stars from the riverbank your father wants you to go home oh you who are responsible for the eternal stars that burn in front of ra prepare the way for unas so that unas can protect us from the fierce and forbidding forces of the night okie dokie uh, not this time but i hope to pass by and visit your mother It uh, pays to explore in this game. Yeah, naughty bits about your father. <laughs> Let's pick up this papyrus. Fertile lands. A few hundred meters northwest of the temple of Sekhmet in Yamu, which resides by Lake Mariotis, there is a great place to go for a date. Full of palm trees and surrounded by desert, one rock fence was built and closed off with no exit. Find me there. Yeah, so we'll pick that up when we uh, get there. I, uh, uh, yeah, I, I know the, the locations of all the papyrus puzzles, so I won't pretend to... Uh, Look for them. <laughs> what I think I'll do, I think I'll reread the uh, puzzle when we get close. So that we know what's going on. Sheba, what in the name of the gods are you doing down there? I wanted to hide, but now I can't get back out. I'm scared. Stay calm. I will help you out of there. That's the last of the children. You are welcome. Tell Menehet that the children are safe. Look at this. Fraud abounds in your market. And you claim you can do nothing? The dealings of the market are beyond me. Speak rather to the offending merchant. <laughs> Priest, you have proven as false as your mummies. Man ahead. Your brood is delivered safely home. Thank you, friend. Hey, what did that fool want with you? Some visitors, having purchased religious objects, are angry when our village has no more dead cats to sell them. Though not a merchant, I am often the means by which the aggrieved snuff their anger. This matter needs a firm hand.
<clears throat> okay, so we got the quest, Ulterior Votive. In, a, in, a, uh, in response to a plea from Menahat, Bayek investigates the sale of false religious icons in the Yamu market. Menahat is worried about the false religious icons sold in Yamu's market, sullying the reputation of both the priesthood and the festival of Sekhmet. He explains that much of Yamu's prosperity is based on the festival, which attracts visitors from all over Egypt. So, we are in an Im investigation. Uh, meet the merchants in the Yamu market. Some merchants might be willing to speak of the false icons. Well, let's go then. the right place, Neb. We have everything you could possibly want. What I want is to ask about false <coughs> items sold at the market. I have heard rumors of such, but there is nothing to them. Now leave if you want to avoid trouble. Ah, something fishy is going on. Let's talk to this guy then. How dare you try These cat mummies are false! This looks like a child made it. Do you know anything of flawed mummies sold to tourists? If you are not here to buy, I have no time for your questions. Menehet, the priest, is concerned about the... And I am concerned about my business. So keep your distance. People aren't willing to talk, it seems. You sold me an amulet of Hathor and my wife got sick anyway. Tell me of the fake mummies being sold here. I have no desire to be dragged into this. Menahed sent me. Your silence is an insult to his holy office. Yeah, I wish to anger neither him nor the gods. They are forced to sell items of lesser quality. Or see our stalls destroyed. Who is behind this? I can say no more now. Let us meet tonight, where the village turns to farmland. <clears throat> the merchant will uh, arrive at the farm at night. We can speak more privately tonight, outside the village. Find me southeast of here, near the fields. Yeah, I think I actually will uh, pick up the quests from here. Let's see. Um, can we uh, do something about these guys? Got the big guy at least. Just watch out this time. Um, the bleeding effect is very useful in these uh, situations, as we can see. That went okay. All right, let's. Uh, yeah, we have some crafting we can do. We can increase melee damage. Sweet. Zemu. Have you seen my book of the dead in your travels, Medjai? I went all the way to Memphis to buy it. No. How was it lost? Bandits. They came from the dunes nearby. When the leader saw how I cared for the book, he wrenched it from me. I thought my heart would stop. I can help. I do not fear them. I have been praying for someone like you. That book will unite me with my wife's spirit. <clears throat> there you are, father. We are going home. But this Magi is helping me. Oh, yes? You are going to find his book? If by some miracle you do, thank you. See you here? Did you hear where the bandits meant to go? Oh, I... Uh, the leader told the others to meet him at the necropolis, I think. We live nearby. I am not going home until I... 
Father, the book is gone. You will find Mother in the field of reeds without it. I promise. That warrior will find the book. Yes, yes. He will find it. Have you found my book yet? Alright, so the quest we got was the Book of the Dead. Suggested level 8. Yeah, we can do it. An old man's cherished Book of the Dead has been ripped from his grasp. Bayak determines to reclaim it from the bandits responsible for its theft. An old man sits in the midst of the Yamu market, mourning his lost Book of the Dead. He explains to Bayek that bandits ripped it from his grasp as he was returning from a journey to Memphis. He asked Bayek to help him find his lost book, directing him towards the necropolis where the bandits were last seen. So let's actually do this one first since it's closer. This looks like a child made it. And uh, let's pick up another quest. Uh, this quest is quite funny, I think. <clears throat> Magi, help me, I will pay you. What do you need? Last night, my dear husband Claudius took a boat out to see the ruins across the lake. He has not returned. None of these brutes honor a wife's pain. I beg you. I will seek him out. Do be quick. I will await you here. What are you coming back to me for? Hurry up! Find Claudius, the missing husband. He was last seen headed for the ruins in Lake Mariotis. The hidden tax. A woman is begging passersby to help search for her husband, Claudius, who never returned from a trip across Lake Mariotis. A woman by the lakeside is begging passersby to help... Oh, it's the same text. Well, almost. So let's actually do this little quest first. It's a short one. Oh, the uh, boats with the sails are a bit faster, but oh well. We took the reed boat. So we are working our way towards Alexandria. Um, I think we'll end the stream when we get to Alexandria. I think that's a good cutting off point. <clears throat> Let me be. I think I'll try the predator bow. The crocodiles are uh, pretty dangerous. And when I le reach level 10, I will equip Corrupted Soul, I think. That uh, looks to be currently the best bow. Claudius and find out why he came out here. Why did you kill them? We had only just met. Claudius, you're drunk. Yes, that is me. And no, I am not. I had only two or ten beers. All right, let's get you back to your wife. I have a wife? Oh, mother will be so pleased. I wonder if he'd be willing to take a breath laxer test to prove he's not drunk. What was your reason for going out there, Claudio? 
Jesus. I was going to remember. I came from Alexandria for the festival. And some kind of someone offered me all night for free. Impossible to re resist. What were we talking about? How you got here. Oh! Right, then I woke up here with those crocodili all around. Tell me, can they really speak? Egypt is a land full of magic and ancient mystery. Amazing. My friends in the city will never believe it. Did you say something about a wife? Uh, yes, yours. See, I do not understand that. How could I have a wife? I am a virgin. At least I think I am. I will hear no more on this subject. You can take it up with your wife. But you do not understand every woman I've ever tried to... Please, shut up. <laughs> oh, I am sorry. I wonder if he'll stay here if I do this location. To just jump off the boat and... Do this really quick. I am feeling much more clear No, he will swim. Splendid. Oh well. So let's um, use a light bow to open these cages. Let's let them hash it out. I hope I don't screw up the uh, quest by doing this. The um, quest system is pretty solid in this game, so I think it'll work. Yeah, the soldiers are doing fine. I should uh, maybe help the lions. Claudius is still swimming around. <laughs> That's quite funny. Hey, hold on. Ooh. Ooh, can I get him still? Can I get him? Yes, I can. <laughs> Epic. So the lions drop uh, pelts, which are uh, somewhat of a rare uh, crafting material. Um, espe especially lions and um, um, leopards, they're really tough animals to kill, so whenever we can we should get them. Alright, let's get you home. Me drunk, married me, 
told me I owed her a virginity tax. Whose virginity? You can go. This is between me and my husband. No, 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 don't, don't go. They'll kill me. Show him what happens when you try to cheat a woman. What the scam? Future, be careful when drinking with strangers. Oh, my aching head. I was so looking forward to surprising mother with my new bride. <laughs> I will never drink again. Edge head. Edge hair. All right, something up here. <clears throat> now let's see um, now we will do the ulterior motive uh, uh, votive quest and we have an ability point uh, what shall we unlock I do want the smoke screen uh, I don't necessarily want the fire bombs. What do I want first, though? No, I won't buy hijack. That's unnecessary. Yeah, let's do the fire bomb and then um, the smoke screen. <clears throat> yeah, let's do this location. I think this is a crocodile lair. <clears throat> and let's switch to the predator bow we have. Yeah, we really need better gear in a while. Yeah, I forgot we are level 10 now, we can equip this bow. dangerous let's uh, equip a hunter bow better than nothing oh we got, got a new predator bow Fishing supply order. This equipment and merchandise is for Mytnofret and his fishing outfit along the Nile. He is located near a den of crocodiles. 
Be careful when transporting to ensure the crocodiles do not damage the materials or eat you. Let's just be sure to loot everything here. Why can't I loot you? Fine, have it your way. Oh, there's another crocodile. They are really dangerous this early. At least in uh, in the pack. Still can't loot you. Oh well. Yes, I do want more health. <laughs> Desperately. Baquette, you're one of the best merchants we deal with. Continue the good work. We're going to send you a big stack of mummies. We need them to be sold by the end of the month. <clears throat> so we need to wait for night time. Let's just uh, do that. Ooh, cats. Let's pet them. Come on, Bayek. Pet the cat. Can be a bit finicky sometimes. You uh, just crouch down to them and he will pet them automatically. There's no input for it. Come on now, Bayek. Ah, later. My friend, I am glad to see you have kept our appointment. Come, sit with me and share a drink of wine. I do not have time for that. It is a beautiful night. Let us enjoy the coolness of the air for a moment before turning to business. Merchant, I am not here to take in the air. Who is behind the traffic of false icons? Well, you see, it is no simple story. There are many involved in this terrible affair, but they would all tell you the same thing. Pity the trusting man, for he suffers great pain. Seek evil, and you will always find it. We will back them. Is that a surprise anymore at this point? <laughs> Trusting. Talk, or you will meet the same fate as your friends. That will not be necessary. Among the dunes, southeast of here, is the bandit camp where the fake mummies are made. I suppose you would go and destroy it now. Better I smash the camp than your head. All right, let's go find the this bandit camp. And the favor of the gods. As Ra lives, what a disgrace. Now I'm uh, getting a little bit sleepy and tired, so um, we will do uh, we will complete this quest and then we will uh, call it a stream. I don't have any more sleeping darts. Let's uh, try to whittle down, or let's kill him and maybe get the drop on the big guy. Ah, I missed him. Let's 
Let's see if I can practice my uh, parry. There we go. Onwards. Trusty steed. If I remember correctly, this is also where the um, daily quest is, so we'll uh, kill two flies with one stone. No, I misremembered. This isn't. Or is it? This is. Is this it? No, it was over here. Never mind. Yeah, I should still play uh, carefully. I'm just level 10. Let's see if we can lure somebody out here. Take them out but one by one. That's the way to do it, in the start at least. So when you um, upgraded uh, the tool pouch capacity. I think the max amount is 13. We currently have three, so that's uh, way too little. But we'll manage. Not a problem. Let's refill our uh, sleep darts and loot this camp. Oh, I should pay more attention to my shields. <laughs> that might help. So we will lose the poison on block. The poison on block perk is actually really good. Damage absorption rate, adrenaline on parry. However, this will uh, give us more HP. I think I'll hang on to my snakes on the shield. I might go back on my previous decision never to upgrade until I'm level 55. I might do that. Depends on what kind of gear I find. Let's see. Oh, oh, fire. Then the head will rest easy now that this is done. All right, let's just fast travel back. Hand in the quest. And then I'll call it the stream after that. I was hoping to finish the uh, all the side quests uh, and locations in um, in Ement Nome and uh, continue upwards to Alexandra, but there's uh, actually a lot to do. Okay, so the trial of Sekhmet, uh, these uh, and the trial of Anubis. This is part of uh, weekly challenges to. Um, uh, kill some really powerful enemies. We uh, won't even attempt that <laughs> until we're at the level cap. <laughs> uh, they give you some extra gear if you do them. Um, yeah, I, I can explain more about that when we get there, but basically we get, uh, I think it's three new pieces of both weapons and shields and three different outfits. So it's a com community effort. But as I said, we're nowhere near uh, able to do them. Ah, here you are. I've dealt with. Oh. How can I use the body? Didn't mean to cut you off, Bayek. Tonight we will stage a grand spectacle. Our goddess Sekhmet defends the people against Ismet's chaos. But Pamu, our champion, is nowhere to be found. The high priest will judge me responsible for his absence. I'll have a look. Sekhmet bless you. His home is near the market. 
But check the tavern first. It pains me to ask you for a further favor. <clears throat> Hamu does like a drink now and again. All right, let's just read the uh, description of the new quest we got. Lady of Slaughter. Yamu's rec recreation of the battle between Sekhmet and Isfet is jeopardized by the absence of Sekhmet's fighter and is up to Bayek to help. Menahet is in trouble again. The festival's biggest event, a recreation of the battle between Sekhmet and Isfet, is in jeopardy as the fighter uh, playing Sekhmet has gone missing. Bayek is enlisted to track him down. Alright, so uh, we are almost uh, level 11, um, but I will uh, end the stream here. Uh, it's getting late for me, <laughs> and I'm tired. Uh, so yeah, this has been Let's Play Assassin's Creed Origins. We, um, we uh, entered the Animus after being out of it for the first time, and uh, we've ventured a little bit into Ement Nome, and um, explored just small parts of Lake Mariotis. Uh, and we're currently doing um, side quests in this area and uh, doing locations. So, thanks for joining in, and uh, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.